speech on independence day good morning to all my respected principal ma'am teachers parents and my dear friends we have all gathered here to celebrate the auspicious occasion of this independence day on 15 august i am very thankful for giving me this golden opportunity to address you all I am a proud Indian to be born in an independent India and therefore would like to acknowledge the sacrifice of our freedom fighters India is the only country where people of different religions caste language and culture stay together happily under one roof this unity in diversity will not be seen anywhere in the world Every year in New Delhi Rajput there is a big celebration where national anthem is sung after the prime minister hoists the flag A salute is given to the national flag by firing 21 guns with the national anthem and flags are shot via helicopters This day is a plethora of emotions it reminds us of the pain of being an and slaved the strength in unity and sacrifices one of the main motive for celebrating independence day is to make the young generation animate of the sacrifices we have made to make this country a better place for them it is our responsibility as a proud citizen of the country to sincerely perform our duty and progress together for the growth and development of our country keeping the sacrifices of our ancestors in mind we should take an oath to carve a better future for our motherland so i bow to those people who freed us from cruel british rulers and now we can do whatever we want in our country without any restrictions The most important contribution to the independence of our country has been made by Mahatma Gandhi, Jawahar Lal Nehru, Sardar Ballabh Bhai Patel, Subhash Chandra Bose, Bhagat Singh, Chandra Sekhar Azad, and many more who contributed to the independence of India and liberated the country from British slavery. We are very fortunate to have found such great freedom fighters. because of them only we are free today and we are achieving new achievements day by day today after independence we have made a lot of progress in the field of education technology sports military strength is equipped with modern weapons which have the power to annihilate any enemy in the blink of an eye agriculture has developed new techniques and methods to produce more qualities and quantities of healthy crops scientific technique india has even reached the moon and mars today while we are discussing the new dimensions of the progress of the country we should never forget our great freedom fighters sacrifices our responsibility does not come to an end by celebrating it today we all should learn to respect our national flag freedom is utmost important we must know how to protect and keep it at last let us take a pledge to develop india more and make it the most advanced clean green progressive country in the world to maintain the unity and integrity of india only then our country will be able to move forward on the path of continuous progress with this great thought i would like to end my speech by paying respect and tribute to those great revolutionaries bharat mata ki jai jai hind ba chand shekhar azad i believe in a religion that propagates freedom equality and brotherhood thank you